currently for this particular um, bunch of hearings, you could call them, uh, the judge has been very lenient with us. Although it's an overflow uh, courtroom, he has allowed myself to sit in the jury box itself uh, pretty much alone. Uh, yesterday there were a couple more artists. They also, he filled the back row of the jury box with other people, but this gives us a view of the person from the front. Otherwise, if we're sitting in the audience, Whitey Bulger would be sitting, I would be looking at the back of his head. Uh-huh. It's composition more in terms of what I look for. I have to pick out who's important. In this first one, I've thought it was very important to see the brother there for the first time. Nobody knew if he would show up or not. That's right. So uh, I thought it was very key in the background that I'd make the twin sister look as well-kept as she was. I try to make, it, make them look as much like the people as possible. And uh, when he was standing, it was almost his body language that was just as interesting. She stood stock still. She didn't do anything. You talked about the individual things you pick up. I noticed her mouth curved down. Uh, I've seen pictures of her beauty from previous days, but she was very unhappy. She did look worried, and she looked upset, very upset. Mm. You've also, you were also the courtroom artist in another recent high-profile case in Massachusetts, and that was the trial of former House Speaker Sal DeMacy. Exactly, and I had lots of time to draw. I have many, many drawings, quite complete. I always tried to get the side of his head, and he, he would look at witnesses. And this is his very famous lawyer. It's Tom Kiley, right? Tom Kiley, and he... Always had his head up, looking down like that. You've got his sort of his his stature and his yeah. jowls and his glasses we just about, right. We talked about uh, body language, and uh, he's extremely tall as well. I have other ones of him standing, but this one happened to be in my case. So I thought I'd show it to you. Both brothers came in. Both Billy Bulger, who was the president of UMass, as you know, and his brother Jackie. And I thought it was very key to put them in together. Mm -hmm. And uh, there they are. There are other people in that audience, but they, of course, had the front row. And they've been very uh, attentive. And when they when they saw them both, uh, Whitey, I saw Whitey smile for the first time. Maybe others have seen him smile from the back of the room, but I had never until then. Are you going to do a drawing with him smiling? Not likely. I uh, I don't have time. <laughs>